Hello, my name is Dr. Rudy Rosen, and I'm your instructor for Texas Aquatic Science and Introduction. I'm a research professor at the Meadows Center for Water and the Environment at Texas State University. I recently wrote the textbook, Texas Aquatic Science, in cooperation with Texas Parks and Wildlife Department and the Hart Research Institute for Gulf and Mexico Studies at Texas A&M University, Corpus Christi. Texas Aquatic Science was modeled after the Missouri Department of Conservation's curriculum, conserving Missouri's aquatic ecosystems, from which some of the text and illustrations were drawn or used and adapted. Funding for our work was provided by the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service's Sport Fish Restoration Program and the Ewing Halsell Foundation from San Antonio. This lesson is adapted from that book published by and available from the Texas A&M University Press. Production of this lesson and video, in part, was funded by a grant from the National Science Foundation through the Research Coordination Network for Climate, Energy, Environment, and Engagement in Semi-Arid Regions. Today's lesson is on life in the water. To help focus today's lesson, here are a few questions to consider. What is a species? What is an adaptation? What adaptations do fish and other aquatic animals possess to survive in an aquatic habitat? How do specific adaptations provide survival advantages to a particular species? Name some of the adaptations of different fish species in Texas. How do fish swim? How do fish see, smell, hear, taste, and feel? Do fish have other senses that we don't have? Finally, how might Texas's aquatic species differ from species in other states, for example, in Oregon, Michigan, or New York? 